A Virginia family who made an unexpected stop in Colorado because of a surprise cancer diagnosis while on vacation is now able to go home. But they couldn't have gotten through it without the incredible support from all of you who donated to Contact 7 Gives. Denver 7's Tom Mustin's been talking to the family since the very beginning, and Tom, they tell you they will never forget the kindness of so many Coloradans, especially our Denver yes. 7 viewers. They have a lot to be thankful for here. When we first met the Thomas family, they told me they were lost. They were trying to process their son's condition in a part of the country they had never even seen before. But all of you, our incredible Denver 7 viewers, really stepped up to the plate. And thanks to your donations, we provided the family with a car and a home, and made them feel welcome here in Colorado. And tonight, they and all of us want to say thank you. We're just really, really um, thankful. An emotional goodbye from a grateful family leaving Colorado. It was almost as if the people here knew we were coming. A state they never thought they'd visit, but now will never forget. It just makes you smile on the inside. Um, and uh, wants you to, it makes you want to give back to when you have the opportunity. A month ago, Nick and Melissa Thomas and their six children were flying back home to Virginia with a connecting stop in Denver. Their 16-year-old son, Marshall, became sick on the plane, was taken to Children's Hospital and diagnosed with leukemia. Their one-hour layover became an indefinite stay in an unfamiliar city while Marshall battled for his life. We had to figure out like where we were going to stay, um, how we were going to get everybody around, uh, like really where in the U.S. are we really? What could have been the darkest moment in this family's history suddenly changed into a heartwarming reminder of the power of love. It's still really overwhelming when I stop to think about it, you know, just that people would um, just care so much about a family they've never even met. When we told the family's story, generous Denver 7 viewers jumped in to help, sending money, prayers, and a whole lot more. Raising enough money to cover this home this is for you all. and a set of wheels. Budget Rent-A-Car gave us a discount on this SUV, and we were there <laughs> when the Thomases piled into their new home. It's amazing. It is going to be absolutely perfect. I can just be like alone in my room and just be like, Alexa, play Taylor Swift. <laughs> More donations from our viewers secured hundreds of dollars in gift cards. We also came up with passes to Elitch Gardens and Rapids and Rockies tickets, along with some Rockies swag. Beyond grateful. It's hard to even have words to express, you know, how much gratitude we feel towards the people of Denver. The family attended their first ever baseball game and are now huge Rockies fans. And while they explored colorful Colorado, Marshall grew stronger, finally leaving the hospital. I was able to get my energy back. Kinda, and now I don't want to stop moving. Marshall has improved enough to be able to fly back to Virginia on Saturday. A homecoming, Melissa says, will be bittersweet. We just felt like we were completely loved on here, and people just took us under their wing and, and made sure that we didn't have anything to worry about, so thank you. And now, boosted by the helping hands of Coloradans, Marshall and his family will continue their fight in Virginia, forever grateful for the kindness of strangers. Mm. I can't thank you enough. Thank you so much. It's been a great, as great of an experience as it could be, you know, with, with what we've had to deal with. Just a terrific family. We also want to thank Dirk and Carrie Holder and King Supers for all they've done for the family. And especially, we want to send out our thoughts and prayers to Marshall Thomas. Marshall, we're really proud of how far you've come, and we know you're going to beat this. So great luck to you. And thank you again to all the viewers out there who helped. That was so heartwarming. Yes. Beautiful. Incredibly giving community. Yes. yes. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Well, there are so many people in our community, like the Thomas family, who need help. So, with the help of the Scripps Howard Foundation, Denver 7 has launched Contact 7 Gives. It's a charitable tax-exempt fund. And if you would like to donate, head on over to thedenverchannel.com. 100% of the contributions will help those in need in our community.